Hey guys, welcome back to Let's Play Final Fantasy IX right here at Missiledyne Online. My name is Corey, but you know that. Alright, so last time on Final Fantasy IX, we went and found out that Quail apparently has no idea who Vivi is talking about, even though that is a big fat lie and he is a liar. Um, but regardless, we can't be too angry at him. Uh, and we also played the frog catching mini game. Uh, of Quinnas, and we also I showed you guys how to eat um, with a fork, so so that's good. I'm glad you guys now know how to eat, because um, eating is good. Eating is very very good. All right, and then we went to the awesome place that is the Chocobo Forest, and we met Choco, and we caught him. Now we're back at Chocobo Forest. With talking to me, the Moogle. The Moogly Moogly. Alright, so you run up here, you talk to him, and then what's the big secret? I wanna know. Well, that's cool. I'll be his master forever. <laughs> no? Okay. Choco has ability to seek out treasures and items hidden underground, but I can't ride Chocobos. Will you help me, Cupo? 60 gil per game, and you keep all the items Choco digs up. I gotta say, Moogles are darn good at running businesses. I'll let you use Choco's ability for 60 gil per minute. Yes, I want to try now. Well, guys, look at that. Two, two mini games, and one little thing. Now for this you run around and you press square. This is called the Chocobo Hot and Cold game. See? That means we're close to it. Do you see that? There it is! That's pretty deep! That's pretty deep! Oh no, can we do it? All you guys do is you run around the map and you press square. Oh, we got a stone with markings on it. Very neat. Alright, so you have a very limited time obviously guys. Now what you want to do is you want to run around and see if you can find any, and that means we're close. That means we're close. Here it is, an antidote. All right. Now you want to run around. You don't want to be hitting it every every couple. You want to hit it, you know, a couple steps here and there. Um, basically, get the main. Oh, we're close. We're close. Here it is. Nice. All right. So you don't. Again, you don't want to hit it every every two steps. You want to like space it out a little bit. That means we're close. That means we're close. It's up here. It's up here. No, where is it? Where is it? No, come on. Yeah, come on, come on, come on, come on. Yes, we got it. We got it. Yeah. Cupo, that's amazing. Yeah, I am. I'll give you bonus time after four discoveries. I'll double the points from here. And I'll give you ten extra seconds. Good. So we have ten extra seconds to find more stuff. After four, this happens every single time, guys. You get an extra bonus, and we're not gonna make it. We're not gonna be able, I'm not gonna be able to get double points. That's too bad, but hey, we still found a stone with patterns, which you guys will see what it is, an antidote 50 gil and a soft, and our beak leveled up twice so we can dig a little bit faster. Um, that is awesome. And we're gonna find out what the stone with patterns is. Yes, we are. There's a picture of some location on the stone. This place must have tons of treasure. Why don't you go out of the forest and look for this place, Cupo? It's free of charge, of course. Well, I would hope so, you son of a gun. I've got idea, Cupo. I've got idea. Let's call this stone Chocograph from now on. And you guys thought that was the minigame? No, 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 you lie. It's a lie. All right. Let's play again. We're going to play again, and we're going to be looking for another stone with patterns on it. Yes, we will be. And because, because that is the real minigame. Sure, this is uh, fun, I guess you could say, running around, trying to find something that is really, really hard to find. Chocograph piece. Well, that stinks. It's not a full chocograph, but it's a piece. Now you can get a bunch of pieces and put them together eventually. Oh, this might be this might be a stone. It might be a stone. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. Yes, we got a chocograph. Awesome, another one. 
All right, so there's one right around here. Something. It could be an item. It doesn't have to be a choker crab. But what I wanted was that second one, just to show you guys that you can get it on, seriously, like, the first one. And I think that's that's pretty cool. Um, so, yeah. And then I will show you where it is and what it is. And that will be something that I'm going to do videos of that will be separate from the main Let's Play, but will still be there. Oh, that stunk. But oh well, I still got 35 points. Not bad, not bad. What's this Chocograph piece? So yes, I will be doing the Chocobo Hot and Cold uh, minigame, searching for the Chocographs throughout the entire world, guys. I will be doing that in a, in a video a playlist, if you will, um, that is going to cover everything. So, except for the first one. It's not going to cover Streamside, because because I, I, I am going to do that for the purposes of this Let's Play. In fact, I'm probably going to do all of them in the course of the Let's Play, obviously, but um, I will still... You'll, you'll see. They'll be their own video. They won't be um, taking up your guys' valuable time if you're not interested in it. If you're not interested in the minigames, which I don't know why you wouldn't be. It's an RPG, guys. Come on, now. Um, and and the, here's the awesome part, is current point 63. So, you remember how you get points? Well, they're not just they're not just numbers. You can actually trade them in for things. Here's the best one, the Robe of Lords. Um, there's only a very, there's very few of these in the game. Um, I don't know if you can buy them. I don't remember off the top of my head. I'll have to check for you guys. But the Robe of Lords is really good. Protect Ring's really good. Uh, Wing Edge, nah, it's just like a throwing item. Um, this is the only place, if I remember correctly, that you can get this card. And Geishal Green's 10, 10 each. And you can also buy Geishal Greens from him and stuff like that. No big deal. All right, so we're going to take a look at Chocographs, and then I will show you guys. Streamside. Go check where the river meets the ocean, Cupo. And then you have Bird's Eye Lagoon. There are so many small mi islands surrounding the Mist Continent, Cupo, which clearly we can't get to it yet. We can't get there yet. We can get this one. See the ability required says field. Um, on this one, it says field and question mark, question mark, question mark. Obviously, we need something else to be able to get there. Um, so that's pretty cool. Streamside will be the one I will show you guys for the purposes of this video. And because it's the one I know where it is fairly, fairly easily. Um, I hope. Imagine if I... That would be stupid. What a great Let's Player if I, if I didn't show it to you guys. But who, who cares? It's the music, you know? So you run back across here where we came. You run across here. And... Boom. Yeah, guys. It was that easy. Right on the world map. And you, all you do is you press square again, just like you did in the forest. Found two elixirs, three high potions, four ethers, two Germinus boots. That's pretty cool, too, because those are pretty good accessories. You can open the trochograph menu, and you can actually switch. See? It's open, meaning we got it. Bird's Eye Lagoon. Obviously, we can't do that yet. And there is a bunch of chocographs, guys. Oh, no, wait. I want to get back on. Nope. Hey. Hey. Give me... Thank you. All right. So, that's it for the mini game in this part, anyways, that I'm going to show you guys. There will be more coming from it, but, but for now... Now, this is what else I want to show you guys. Remember how I said, you always want to look for these and go to them on the world map. Well, I mean, you'll know where they are because you're watching the video, so I can show you where they are. This is a different one. Look familiar? We saw this in an ATE, an active time event, with Senna and Baku in them. See? A, a coffee. A mocha coffee. Hmm, I wonder if Senna left it for us there. But if you guys remember, the old man in the mountain by Dali wanted coffee. Didn't he? Didn't he? And this, you can actually take a sip. Ah, fully healed. Yeah, man. All right, so you can run up here. Now, this is one of the gates. Um, geez, I want to say, I want to say this is uh, one of the one of the south gate. Pass through the mountains, underneath the mountains, I would assume. You can't actually go in. That's that's ver literally what I just showed you. That's it. That's it to the whole place. So, oh well, you know. Oh well. Now, we don't have to catch a, choco -go a, cho a chocobo again, because there's one right here. Oh, yeah. 
same one. Now there's nothing really over here, nothing that's going to interest you guys. There is this forest, however, and, oh, look at this, time of day changed. Interesting. But yeah, you can run all the way around here, and I believe there's actually a chocograph like somewhere, but... I mean, you can't you can't just search for them without finding the chocograph. You actually have to find them. So, let's... No, I don't want to do that. I want to search in here, because I'm pretty sure this is the forest where I can find the mandragoras. And mandragoras are pretty, actually, pretty tough enemies that are kind of hard. Or I can find this guy. It should be the ragtime mouse, which is kind of odd. You know, I can never find him when I want him, right? Oh, jeez, let's hope I know the trivia. Oh, God, what a terrible LP or I'll be. Pop quiz. Question number two. The Fifth Limblum War, 15th, started in 1600. I believe that's actually f true? No, I think it's false. Uh, I'm gonna be totally wrong on this one. I'm gonna be totally wrong. Hey, if I'm wrong, you guys heard me say it was true first. Am I wrong? Uh, oh, yeah! Hey, guys. Hey, guys. Hey, guys. Quick question. Uh, who's the best lp -er of this game? <laughs> Corey is. Yeah, that's right. Uh, oh. My manliness just went up a whole nother notch. Whole nother notch. Ladies? Yeah, it did. Right? Do you agree? You agree. <sighs> Anyways. Mandragoras. Let's look in here for Mandragoras. Mandragoras, 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 Mandragoras. Yeah, 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 yeah. And there they are. Good. Now, what we want to do here is we don't want to kill them. We want Zidane. Not Zidane. Zidane can't eat them. We want the beautiful Quinna to eat one. And you guys are probably going, uh, but, but Cory, why would you want him to, to do that? Um, because I said. Because I said, that's why. Alright, come on, eat him. What? Come on, you guys are, you guys are potty mouths. All right, I don't want to kill it. Okay, come on. Zidane, attack him. I want to see how much... All right, maybe that was enough damage to... Uh-oh. Uh-oh. I'm totally going to accidentally kill them all. And that's going to stink. I don't care. I don't care. I just want to eat one. Okay. Okay, if I can't eat this one... Okay, there we go. Yes! Alright, so I got Limit Glove. Guys, seriously, Limit Glove is going to make... Uh-oh. I'm just gonna try to run away now. Limit Glove is going to make everything so much easier. Did you really just miss that, Quinna? Okay, we're gonna die. Did did you guys just see that? Did you guys... Were you guys just there for that? Did that seriously just happen? That was really embarrassing. That was superly duperly embarrassing, guys. I want out of this forest. Anyways, let's heal. Let's heal up our guys. That sucks. That was stupid. Oh well. Remember, you can press square on the world map and use Mogugugu. Mog Moguga. Mogua. Mog Moguga Gidigigi. Mogadigidigidigidigidi. Mogadigidigidigidigi. So anyways, that was fun and all. You know. I appreciated that. But we got Limit Glove. 
Yeah, I'm gonna show you guys. Damn it. I'm gonna show you guys what Limit Glove is. Because you guys are gonna look at it and be like, I don't see the big deal. No, that's not that's not the case here, guys. That's not the case. Causes non-elemental damage to the target when your HP is one. So when Quinna's HP is only one, one, it does so much damage. So much damage. You guys will see. You guys will see. You you guys will totally see what I'm talking about when this happens. I'm just saying. I'm just saying. But that's all. That's all for now, folks. See you next time on Let's Play Final Fantasy IX. I'm going to actually do some chocograph hunting. Now, I'm not going to go get it, but I'm going to go in the Chocobo Forest and hunt some up uh, off screen and do a little bit of off screen training, probably only to level eight or nine uh, around the board. And of course, also eat some things. And then I will see you guys right back here later. Thank you for stopping by. Be sure to like and subscribe and comment. Have a good one.